Hey guys, so we're still here at the Drive Festival at the 4x4 test track. So today we're going to take out this new Santa Cruz. <laughs> so I assume it's a 2021 model? 2022. 2022, holy smokes. And, yes, and this kind gentleman's going to take us out. And your name, sir? Bobby. Bobby, thank you, Bobby, and stuff like that. So this is the vehicle we're going to go in, guys. So Bobby, tell us a little bit about this vehicle. So like I said, it's a 2022, so this is a vehicle that the dealers don't actually have yet. Uh, so we'll be one of the first ones to drive it. Thank you. Uh, this one we'll be going in is the Ultimate 4x4, okay? Uh, All-wheel drive vehicle. Uh, so this is our uh, basically almost top end. Uh, price point of around $45,000. That's Canadian, guys. Uh, that's Canadian, uh, absolutely. And uh, I mean, it's... Uh, just keep in mind, uh, we don't refer to it as a, as a truck, it's more of a uh, 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 sport vehicle, oh, okay. a truck. Okay. Um, uh, so, so don't, don't kind of uh, you know get that uh, get that mixed up. Uh, okay. And that, I mean, you, you'll find the ride. It's a very smooth, comfortable ride. We have some really bumpy roads that we're going to go on, and you'll see, uh, and you'll see how it handles, how smooth it is. When we're saying the bumps. That's okay. fantastic. Yeah. Come on in, and let's uh, let's see. Excellent. Now, Bobby, do you feel okay holding my camera while I drive? I can do that, yeah. yeah. Okay, so you just, just hold it here, so otherwise it'll, you hold it down here, it'll, it'll turn like that. Sounds good, I can do that. There you go. <laughs> okay. Yeah. As well, this is our 2.5 liter turbocharged. Four cylinder, I guess. Uh, it is, yeah, yeah absolutely. Okay, this is exciting. All right, so just make sure I don't know uh, this pushing positioning of the seat, but you want to be kind of at a, at a pretty good height so you can kind of see somewhat um, over and above the hood. All right, sounds good to me. Looks like I can see fine, so right. it's excellent. Sounds good. Whenever you're ready, uh, we're just gonna head straight down there along the fence. All right, and uh, our uh, our speed uh, anywhere from zero to fifteen would be maximum that we're gonna do. Okay, well, I'll go above zero, so at least we're moving. Absolutely, <laughs> <laughs> and that's kilometers. <laughs> so thank you very much, Bobby, for taking no me out. No, no problem. It's a beautiful day. It is very nice. Yeah, the weather's really nice out here actually all weekend. So where are you coming in from? Toronto. Oh, awesome. Yes. How, was, uh, how was the traffic out? Was it okay? It was actually not bad. Okay. There's some construction coming north from Bowendale. Ah, uh, okay. Uh, so that's fine. You know, they just have stop and go. It's fine. So now we're going through the woods. There we go. Perfect. Yeah, and I mean, it's, you know what? I uh, It's a really nice sort of trail just enough for yeah there you go for people who've never kind of been off-roading to give them a really good experience i think it's great and to have to have people demonstrate a chance to drive this vehicle sure. demonstrate how what it can do sure because people might be scared yeah, exactly to yes. drive it <laughs> but if they feel more confident and comfortable driving it in a control so, environment with an expert so if you see this little hill coming up here now you can choose to sort of go on the side okay put the two right wheels on the side and kind of just see the articulation and see how stable it feels you know sort of on its side yeah, there you go what's the uh, angle 30 to 45 this one's about a 42 degree angle 42 yeah excellent nice so i mean again that's just showing the stability of, of the vehicle It's gingerly drive. Mm -hmm. Show its capabilities. Yeah, I mean, there's a few spots actually uh, um, further up ahead, and uh, that'll kind of more or less show the, the turning radius of it, and because the, the very, uh, very narrow turns. Oh, well, that's good. So make a right turn. Uh, no, just follow this along. Yeah, it's blocked off. <laughs> All right. Now, I assume this does not have a skid plate underneath, or does it? Does it doesn't, no. It's such a beautiful day. Mm -hmm. Especially in here. <laughs> yeah. As long as I give you water, you'll be fine. Oh, yeah. You got the tent for shade. Yeah.
So you got to, uh, I guess, uh, try this out yesterday or just this morning? No, no, we, we tried it out uh, yesterday. We went on a few different trails. We tried out all the vehicles just, just to kind of see, you know, the spots and how they handle in certain areas. Sure. So we're going we'll B, I understand. Yep, yeah, we'll take B. Not too much traffic in the woods. No. <laughs> so to watch out for the uh, the critters. <laughs> that's right. I think they have to watch over us. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. <laughs> but uh, you probably, uh, I don't know, you might see some squirrels. I don't know. Oh, maybe yeah, yeah. some deer. Oh, yeah, we've already seen a few running around, a few squirrels. Yeah. Deer have not seen. Yeah, you can bring some peanuts tomorrow. You know? <laughs> <laughs> but no bears. That's more northern Ontario. No, Ontario. that's right. Yes. When I do some videos and stuff like that, people go, oh, watch out for the bears. And I like, that's okay. <laughs> <laughs> so this will be a bit of a hill, hill climb. I mean, it's 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 nothing nothing drastic, so this will do it no, uh, no problem. That's it. Beautiful. I mean, as, long as you can see, sort of, you know, quite smooth over over all this <laughs> uneven trade. Yeah, and it's very capable. Mm -hmm. Now when it's struggling, does it, uh, does something with a suspension like lock or something? That's right, yeah. So, so I mean, keep in mind, it can go up to a 50-50 split, right? Okay. So where it can split that torque. Um, so if it does struggle, um, it will um, split the torque um, and push itself up. As, as quick as possible. Now does it 50-50 but does it go left or right as well? The Like if it's pivoting, can the vehicle it, pivot? It, it will uh, as well send power to individual wheels, yes. That's fantastic. So cable. Well, this will be a, a nice vehicle for for young people getting into the market. Eh? I it's think like so. A, yeah. It's like a fun, fun vehicle. Oh, you're, it's a small, yeah, it's, it's something is there that we always catch, whatever that is. <laughs> ah, it's just branches. No brand, yeah. <laughs> as long as you don't hit the tree trunks, you're good. No, 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 we're good. <laughs> I was <laughs> watching. <laughs> I was watching. <laughs> so. No, I think, I think it will be exactly that vehicle that you just said, you know, with, with, with you know, people that bike, you know, any kind of mountain biking, stuff like that, you know, throw those in the back. Um, yeah, I love the bed. That's yeah, good. Yeah. It's just, uh, it's funny when you get this vehicle, guys, I'm talking mm -hmm. to people in the mm -hmm. YouTuber, people in the YouTube world, you get a lot of friends that are going to ask your help to move. <laughs> <laughs> it's usually how it is. <laughs> but hey, that's what you do for friends mm -hmm. and family. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Excellent. This will just uh, our grass here. Here, this will just kind of guide us back. It's a little bumpy through here, so you can still feel a bit of the suspension. Yeah, extremely capable. As long as people don't drive too fast, is you don't want to too hit some bumps you don't sure. see. You know. Take it easy. There's no rush. Like they say, guys, 15. 15 is the ideal speed. But the rougher the train, the slower you go. Exactly. <laughs> now, if you get part way up a hill, mm -hmm. uh, can you stop and then start to go again and it'll still pull its way up? Yeah, yeah. We, we, we've tried that as well. Yeah. yeah, yeah so you don't have to worry about anybody getting stuck then. Yeah. You got any people get scared and say, I can't go. <laughs> no, not, not yet. <laughs> okay. No few problem. of them, few of them were surprised as to, you know, the, just, just what we're taking them on. They, they weren't expecting it. Right? Yeah. They were expecting more like a grab. Yeah, if you just go around, around? yeah, you should be able to just park uh, between those. beside the red one there. Yeah, they, they were expecting more like gravel, you know, some uneven surface, something like that. Yeah. So they were not expecting this. They were quite, like quite happy. A real 4x4 four four track. Yeah. Which is very exciting. There we go. Excellent. Thank you very much, Bobby. You're welcome. Not a problem. I appreciate it. 
So guys, don't forget to like and subscribe. <laughs> Thumbs up, guys. Thank you to Bobby and Hyundai for this good experience. So make sure to take a chest out. Go to drivefestival.com. There's still spots opening on Saturday and Sunday. Book online, so you got disappointed. They also accept some walk-ups if there's availability. So thumbs up. Thanks, guys.